payday for the Malaysian national athletes who receive a total of 6.2 million ringgit for their achievements. The money was handed out on Wednesday by the government under the National Sports Incentive Scheme. Medalists from this year's Asian Para Games in Indonesia received the biggest amount of 2.9 million ringgit. Among the notable recipients were para athlete Rizwan Puzi, with the mink gymnast Amy Kwan, Azizul Hasni Awang, bowlers Rafiq Ismail, Adrian Ang, and Tun Amiru Hakim Tun Hasno Azam, as well as the Penchak Silat exponents. The Youth and Sports Ministry also announced a new monthly allowance scheme which will pay athletes 500 ringgit more for winning medals in the Asian Games and Commonwealth Games starting from next year. Sekarang kita akan pertingkatkan kepada 4,000 ringgit. Perak daripada 3,000 ringgit, sekarang ke 3,500 ringgit. Gangsa daripada 2,500 ringgit, sekarang kepada 3,000 ringgit. Mungkin ada yang bertanya, kenapa sukan Asia dan Commonwealth dia? Because the base is larger. Kita nak pastikan bahawa kita merangkumi sebanyak atlet yang mungkin. Sambil kalian semua berjuang, ada kalian perlu mati-matian untuk pastikan bahawa negara akan ke hadapan, we must ensure that your welfare is well taken care of. The allowance for Olympic medalists will remain at 7,500 ringgit for a gold, 7,000 ringgit for a silver and 6,500 ringgit for a bronze. Later, the minister also said the National Sports Council had signed a memorandum of understanding with University Tunku Abdul Rahman and University Kuala Lumpur to provide athletes a chance to pursue studies. Di mana mereka akan berikan biasiswa, fleksibiliti dari segi masa pengajaran dan subjek yang diambil untuk pastikan bahawa atlet kita dapat masuk ke sana jika mereka ingin uh, dapat ijazah dan juga bagi bekas atlet. Uh, kita nak expand setiap negeri, uh, sekurang-kurangnya ada satu. Itu bukan